Medical interns trading their stethoscopes for hammers and nails, all to give a Florida woman a sense of freedom in her own home. ABC 27's Cara Bailey shows us what volunteers are doing to lend a hand. While many people are taking the day off, a few future doctors have all hands on deck to make a difference in the community. Altogether, 12 new Tallahassee Memorial Healthcare interns spent their day off teaming up to build a new landing ramp for Gail Jones. Jones lives in this Havana home with her daughter and grandchildren. The steps she had previously were outdated and unsafe for someone with mobility challenges like her. So we removed the center block steps, which were atrocious, and we uh, built a uh, what we call an accessibility landing, uh, door landing. It's five feet wide and it comes out about four feet. The wider landing and shorter steps makes it easier for people with limited mobility to move in and out of their homes. As Dr. Joe Masiata explains, building the ramp for someone who could possibly be one of their patients offers interns a unique perspective. Well, I think it's all about the perspective and you see how, how people live and, you know, where they live and, you know, these are the people we're going to be taking care of. So it's it's one thing seeing them in a nice, clean, sterile environment of the hospital or the office, but it's another thing, you know, seeing the some of the challenges they have. Evan says it's a perfect and productive way to spend the holiday. Today, every one of them came out on their day off to give back to this family so that they could have better accessibility. To me, that's what the spirit of America is, and that's the reason why we need to celebrate the 4th of July. Jones planned to be here while the doctors were building the landing, but ended up having to make a hospital visit instead, which means doctors are taking care of her both there at the hospital and right here at home. In Havana, Cara Bailey, ABC 27. That is great, and the team of 12 volunteers split their time between Jones's home and another home in Havana today.